Hey, how are you doing today? Good, I hope. Today's video is not going to be like my usual videos. And the, the reason for this is because I've been seeing a lot that people tend to blame things that happen on other people instead of taking the blame for their own actions. I don't understand why people that are supposed to be adults have to blame somebody else for something that happens to them. And then maybe it's not meant for me to understand. And if that's the case, then that's fine. But my whole thing is this. If you want to be treated like an adult, then you should act like an adult. And by acting like an adult, I mean this. You need to take responsibility for the things that you do to other people and the things that you do to yourself. If you catch yourself in a situation where you know the outcome of this situation is not going to be something that you need to be doing or you should be doing, then remove yourself from the situation. I don't know how much more clear that can be to a person. And you may be saying, well, what if the person can't control what's going on? That's some baloney. You can control anything that happens in your life. And there may be some things that you just absolutely cannot control. And I understand that. But when you put yourself in a situation, you clearly have control over everything that happens. I don't want to be mean or be rude, but I am sick and tired. I mean sick and tired of people not taking responsibility for their own actions. In what universe is it okay for you to blame something that happened on someone else when you can control the si when you could have controlled the situation? Like I just don't understand that. I don't get it. And maybe in 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 I'm not going to try and understand or grasp the concept or, un or get the situation because I'm 21 years old and I've learned that if you feel that a situation is not going to be conducive to the type of person that you are or to your character as a person, then you shouldn't be in this and then you shouldn't put yourself in that situation point blank period i don't care if ooh, all my friends are doing it so i'm gonna do it no be your own trendsetter follow your own rules but don't follow behind somebody else because oh well i don't want my friends to look at me different or talk about me because i'm not doing what they're doing if your friends are doing something that is harmful, then why would you want to take part in that? To cause yourself harm? To cause yourself pain? No. I don't know. I, well, I think about it. I thought that I didn't know a person like that. But in recent experiences, I've come to the realization that People aren't exactly who they say they are. Because if you're saying one thing and doing another, then how can you judge somebody else who's doing the same thing that you just did, but you claim that you're not doing it? And I know you pro you're probably sitting here like, what are you talking about with all these puzzles? Like, I don't understand. I'm like this. There's no reason 
for any person to go through anything in life and always put the blame on someone else. Now, I know that you are probably looking at this video like, really? Why? Like, I don't understand. But I just feel that more people should be true to who they really are. You shouldn't try to be somebody that you're not or try and change the person you are to make somebody else happy. Now, if you're in a relationship with somebody and, you know, the person that you're dating doesn't like certain things about you as far as your personality or things that you like to do or things that you enjoy doing, then I mean there has to be a compromise. Things that they enjoy doing, if they enjoy hanging out with people or doing this and doing that, if they want you to stop doing the things that they don't like, then they should, ha I, feel, I feel that they should give up or do the same. In other words, practice what you preach. Like, if you tell me that, oh, Marquise, you're 21 years old, why do you watch cartoons? I watch cartoons because cartoons are good. I like cartoons. Cartoons are funny. But you can sit and do basically the, the, same, the same exact thing. But when I say something to you about it, oh, it's a big problem. But you want me to stop doing or being the type of person that I am. But when I ask you or s suggest that you do the, do the same thing that you're trying to make me to stop doing, you get upset or you don't want to talk about it. That baffles me. I personally am not going to conform myself to be anyone but myself. And if you can't accept me for who I am and what I am, then there's no reason for us to have any type of conversations. There's no reason for us to be in any relationship. And this goes more for than just a relationship. It could be friends, family, you know, people at work, whatever. If they can't accept, if a person can't accept you for who you are, and the type of things that you enjoy doing, or you know, whatever the situation may be, then you shouldn't let that person be in your life. Because if you change who you are to suit the person they want you to be, you're going to end up losing yourself. And there's no purpose in you losing yourself because, oh, well, if I act like this, then they'll want to be around me more or they'll like me more. A person shouldn't want you to change who you are just so you, you, just so you can be with them. They should want to be with you for who you are. Not, oh, well, I want you to change this, and if you don't change this, then me and you can't be together, or me and you can't be friends. This is what you should do if, you ever, if you're ever in that type of situation. Somebody tells you, if, you know, a, per, a boy or girl that you like tells you, oh, well, I want you to do this, and I want you to stop doing this, you know, me and you can be together. Or if it's a friend, they tell you, well, I don't want you to do this. You know, can we, you know, can you not be like that and just be this way? Yeah. Chuck them the deuces and send them on about their merry way. Because there's no purpose in you losing the person you are just to make somebody else happy. But that is going to be the end of this video. Um, next week's video is going to be more upbeat and more positive and more happy and more smiles and giggles. But this topic has really been weighing heavy on me for since since I posted last week's video. And I just, I can't take it. I can't, I, I just, there's no purpose in any person being anyone but who they are. But once again, my name is Marquise.
Thank you for watching. All my social media links will be in the description below. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you are not already. And so that you don't miss my videos that I upload every Thursday.